hello everyone and welcome to Close to the Sun. I pressed a button, did it do something? Okay, we're good. So this game has been on my kind of schedule for a while. Uh, well, it's been on my radar for even longer, I would say. Um, I knew about it a while ago, but I just couldn't get my hands on it. I don't remember the reasoning why. I don't know if it was on just a like a different platform that I didn't have available to me, but I'm excited to get into it. Prologue, the brilliance of Ada, Ada. So I heard the game's about six hours long. My dear sister, so I left you suddenly and without warning. For that and so much more to come, I apologize. I didn't board the Helios knowing what would happen, only that pursuing my research could change the world. And we did! Just not in the way I'd imagined. Not yet, anyway. I want to explain everything now, so that you'd see that there is nothing to fear. You've always tried to protect me, my big sister, but this was meant to be. It's now my turn to protect you, if only so that things unfold the way they are meant to. The graphics are really good. Time and necessity has kept us apart, but that is about to change. We need you here aboard the Helios with me. I've enclosed a receiver, and as the name implies, it can receive signals to which we will communicate. I know a little of this will make any sense right now, but I also know that you will keep your promise. I okay, love so I got a little uh, walkie-talkie, little earpiece. Pretty light on details there, Ada. You leave without warning, and now meet me aboard the Helios. What are wow, this looks really good. So, I hate to be that guy, but every review that I looked at compared this game to Bioshock, and I'm kind of seeing the themes a little bit, so we will see how that's reflected. I don't know how... did it tell me? Okay. Oh, there's even stuff outside you can see. Yeah, so I saw this game a while back. I think I saw the trailer for it a good while ago. Like, we're talking maybe like half a year, maybe even more actually. Um, and I didn't pick it up. I don't think I could at the time. But, you know, everyone was talking like, oh, this looks a lot like Bioshock, blah, 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 blah. So, I was interested in it. So, I actually saw it was on sale like a couple of days ago. So, picked it up. Super excited about it. Here we go. I don't feel like I should be here or should be able to access this system. Okay, so I did hear there's not a combat, so it's more of like puzzle and storytelling, which I'm totally fine with. Um, I think it actually will be kind of refreshing from uh, games that I've been playing recently that are more intensive on combat and stuff like that. It also seems like this game does have horror elements, even though I don't think it's meant to be considered in that genre. but. Just from the stuff that I've seen and what I remember, I know stuff goes kind of sideways. Okay, so that wasn't the Helios itself. See, when I, I started, I was like, oh, I'm already on the Helios, but this this craft must be the Helios, which, I mean, just given from the name, I expected it to be something that goes into the, uh, the sky. Which it still might, just might be docked in the water. But just from the name, that's what I would expect. Well, I'm super impressed with the graphics. Um, already, uh, I, I do think this is going to be a fun, immersive experience. I don't know anything about the story going into this, so... Close to the sun. Let's do it. Okay, chapter one. If that's how fast the chapters go, we're gonna blaze right through this. <laughs> I'm just joking. Prologues are pretty quick. Okay. Oh, wow. You're kind of hit with that atmosphere right off the bat. How... Oh, there we go. I thought the great Helios would be more... busy? 
I guess Ada didn't tell anyone I was coming. Yeah, I was gonna say, it's like totally empty. I guess I was the only one on that, that craft. This is a very unorthodox way of getting onto a place. It's already kind of spooky, you know? There's nobody here. That looks really cool. How am I supposed to get across? That water. Uh, that's a good question. Can I extend a uh, bridge? Seems like I'll have to let myself in. The ship rat. Kinda creepy. Active spy. Isolate and eliminate. That's crazy looking. So I wonder what all these little, uh, little dots are. That only kind of got me. Surprising, but not really scary. I should run. Oh, is that a zoom? It is. Warden Cliff, a company distributing electricity to half of the world, and yet still hungers for that other half. Quarantine? What have you got yourself into, Ada? Whoa. Great! Yeah, I, I hate being that guy, but this totally gives off Bioshock vibes. Whoa. There's some guy screaming. So, there were two comparisons that I saw. One was comparing it to Bioshock, which I see a lot in the theme, uh, the themes and the general art style of the game. And then Outlast was the other game that people uh, compared it to. So I'm half expecting for something to run out at me and I have to run away from it versus fight it. Disable two security overrides to reactivate the elevator. Oh, that was paint? Or someone was using blood as paint. Oh, I can touch stuff. It's a nice touch. Let's see what I did there. Can I grab that from here? Hello? Any anyone there? Yeah, I could imagine Rapture looking something like this before things went to crap for like a long period of time. Like this is what it would look like if things went to crap and this was like a week later or something. I need to get in there. There's a door there. Did I check down here at the end of the hallway? Wow, I almost missed that. This is Nikola Tesla speaking, and unless it wasn't oh, already, Tesla. this ship is under strict warranty. There is to be no movement on or off the Helios. And yet, here you are. Another one of innocent spies. I, I was just messing around with that. Profile Gee. armless. Thanks for the warm welcome. Now what have you Okay, done? so Tesla. Do I need to know this stuff? Okay. Here we go. Okay. One more to go. So that's one. I have to find the second one, which I assume is probably on like the other side of where I'm at. Um Let's go ahead and open the door just so I can get back there easier. Oh, could I follow the pipe to where that was? I actually can't see it very well because my room is so well lit up. I might have to either increase the brightness of it or... That's the other one right there. Can I squeeze through? Oh, come on, you could totally make that. Could just force it a little bit and slide right through. This was perfect. Alright. Okay. 
right, I will let them let them be. So that's what the code was for the first one. Okay. That should do it. Now Sweet. to find Ada. I do want to look around a little bit. Because I do feel like there's a lot to be discovered. I feel like this would do something if I... Hmm. Which means it's a combination of... Oh. So this is how suspected Edison spies get interrogated aboard the Helios? Oh, this was a torture room to... Wait until my editor hears about this. Okay. I'm glad it's only two if it was three that the combinations are a lot higher. Um... So they're really worried about sabotage. Feel free to get creative. Okay. So there were spies sent from Edison to steal information from Tesla. I think that's a fair gathering. I almost got like a, an out, not an outlast, a uh, amnesia feeling. Just the... Oh man, is this how fast I climb? I guess it's realistic. Like uh, the second one. A Machine for Pigs. Or whatever it was called. Kind of more like this. More industrial. Just the pure silence of this is so off-putting. There's no music. Nothing. Okay. Um, that's the key. Borders of Hermes. So that was chapter one. First impressions just from the first, the prologue in the first chapter. I can appreciate the the atmosphere they're going for. I don't know how many chapters there are. I should look that up just to be aware. <coughs> Excuse me. <clears throat> so pretty. Oh wow. Yeah, total Bioshock vibes. This is lead researcher Except Archer for this incredibly any unloaded. Survivors on this frequency? Is anyone out there? The oh, that's way bigger than I thought it was. This is lead researcher Archer calling for any survivors Anything? on this frequency. Is anyone? Ada. Rose? Ada! Holy shit, Rose! Ada! What the hell are you doing here? Wait, what? Ada, you told me to come. I've got your letter right here. That... That doesn't make any sense. I didn't write you any letter, Rose. But, God, but never mind. Call lousy if service an accident or for sabotage, it, it doesn't matter. We need to get off this ship. That's what the quarantine is about? Ada, what the hell is going on? Rose, listen very carefully. We really need to leave. It's spreading all... Ada! It's Ada. spreading? Ada. Is there some kind of disease happening? So this is the vessel that we are on. So it's a ship. It's huge. I don't know if uh, I don't my history knowledge of what Tesla's ambitions were are pretty. Named after the sun itself, a source of almost unlimited power. This is a safe space for those with an open mind and a talent for the scientific arts to expand the limits of human endeavor. Away from prying eyes and cynical money men, here all that matters is progress as we reach for the very stars themselves. It is our floating home and the cradle of mankind's technological evolution. You walk within the very future of the human race, and you are most, most welcome. Yeah, that's like exactly what Andrew Ryan wanted to do. Have a separate society away from uh, 
the different societies that man had created at that point. Oh wow. It's really cool looking. I'll give him that. A very vain man, but... What are you reading? Looks empty. Death Ray. This is the machine with which I intend to rid the world of war once and for all. My dear Death Ray. It may seem contradictory that such a thing could promote peace, but possess this none would even consider military action against us. That's the theory at least. That generally doesn't seem to work. If I get chased by something, there is no way I can outrun it. What could possibly go wrong? Give it a little nudge. Birds? Well, seagulls, I would assume. Okay, no wave. Whoa. Whoa. Hi there. That's kind of creepy. Hello? Anyone? Yeah, I can totally understand why people are like, this is a lot like Bioshock. This is probably what a splicer society was like before everybody went insane. Oh. What the hell? Oh, and I can still see them. Yeah, I can hear you, but what the hell am I doing here? If you didn't write the letter, who did? It's in your handwriting and everything. That's weird, dude. This is gonna dude. sound weird, but it might have been me. Not present me, but future me. I know how crazy that sounds, but I promise I can explain everything. Okay. Let's rendezvous in my apartment. From there, we'll escape together, okay? Escape from what, exactly? It's not safe here, Rose. It's spreading throughout the ship. I'll tell you everything when we meet up in my apartment. You need to grab a Faraday keycard from the check-in desk there in the main hall. They're kept in a wall-mounted safe. The combination should be written down somewhere nearby. The keycard will automatically take the elevator to the right district. Did you get all that? Yes. Open safe. Get keycard. Use elevator. Meet in your apartment. I got it. Great. It's really only one thing. Open the safe and then just go forward. So just get there and stay safe, okay? Fine. But when so you get there, safe? I'm expecting some answers. Deal? Deal. So it's a man it breaking exists. his shackles, that's cool. Even if I can't explain why or how you got here, really am grateful that you're here. There's something right See there. See you soon. See you soon, sis. Okay, so I need to find the safe from the wall mounted safe. The combination should be written down nearby, is what they said. Okay, here's the safe. That must be the safe. Now to get it open. Oh, it's only three numbers? That shouldn't be too incredibly difficult. Oh, 142. That was a lot easier than I thought it was going to be. Okay. One. Oh, I see what you're doing. That's not what I meant to do. But it actually turned out to be in my favor. 142. Take one of those. Bingo. A key card I here. probably should take more than one of these. All right, puzzle done. All right. Hope this works. Almost half expecting something to start running after me as soon as I, I got the key card. The fire of Prometheus. Okay, we're just blazing through. I think we'll do one more chapter tonight. When in danger, run. So am I going to have to? Uh, do puzzles, avoid enemies. Well, that's that's kind of exactly what you do with Amnesia, is you you go into an area, well, at least later on in the game, it's more like solve a puzzle in an area while avoiding the monster. So I could probably see something like that happening. The home of Hestia. Okay. Ugh, what is that smell? Very nice. So I think we'll finish this one, call it good. I'll do another set of three, and then we'll uh, do a set of four to wrap it up. Locked. 
locked. Great. This one's probably also locked. Uh, what? Rose, did you reach my apartment district yet? Yeah, yeah. But this door <laughs> won't open. I don't think you want to open. There, champ. Try putting your considerable weight behind it. Did you just call me fat? Oh, that's great. Oh, man. Oh, my God. What's going on? They're in pieces, Ada. Shit. Get me out. How do I get out? Rose? Rose! It's gonna be okay. Rose, listen to me. You're having a panic attack. Just focus on my voice, Rose. Close your eyes and just focus on my voice. Breathe with get me. Get out of the room, too. One leaf in. One thorn out. Hmm. Like one that. leaf in. One thorn out. <clears throat> one leaf in. One thorn out. There you go. Good. Good. Time is not a river. We've been butchered, Ada. Who or what did this? yet but right now we need to get you safe make your way to the center of the apartment yeah complex. let's get out There's of here a generator that will open the gates focus on that for now i'm on my way i'll broadcast to you again shortly be careful sis i'll try wow whoa okay that one got me a little bit just a little bit Time is not a river. I know, I'm just looking around. Oh, that was a bug. I thought it was somebody humming. Yee. Oh boy. This is where they're gonna introduce the, the threat. Don't think I should go in front of it. <sighs> yeah. <clears throat> Interesting. Are these visions from the past? <clears throat> Excuse me. This is a disaster. Okay, yeah, I figured. I almost want like a flashlight. That must be it. Let's okay. see about getting some lights on in here. Primary emergency power line. What the heck do I do with these? There's a code. What if I just flip the switch? I felt good about that one. Okay, there's no way I'm just going to random guess that. I need to read it. Oh. <laughs> there's a code right in front of me. One, one, two, one, three. Wait, which one is it? Okay, so it's green, so we're good there. One, one, two, one, three. There we go. One, one, two, one, three. Ding! Okay. See, the nice thing about these puzzles is they're super straightforward. There's not a whole lot of, like, backtracking to find something or looking around for it. It's just kind of in the general area. Ada! Ugh, oh, about damn time. What took you? <clears throat> Hello? Who is this? If you've harmed my sister, I swear to God I will break every phone. I haven't harmed anyone, alright? My name's Aubrey. 
and it's really, really nice to finally talk to someone who isn't decomposing, you know. Never mind, sorry. But you have got to get me out of here. I'm holed up in the engine halls, starboard side, deck 82. This is a mail system. Kind of trapped, actually. How soon can you get here? Look, buddy, I can't make any promises. I'm going to get my sister off this thing, but if we can, we will come to get you too. How does that sound? Oh, yeah. That's what the letter Don't mentioned. Don't mind me. I'll just sit here and starve. No problem. That's all oh, right. No, Benny here, the Constantine, is not again at work, but he still has most of his spine intact. Maybe he can lend it to you so that the next time the person in need asks for help, you will have enough of a backbone to actually do something. Whoa, buddy. Ah. Alright, this is not the right way. Okay. So, one was triangle, which was this one. Then one was a triangle with a slash, so happy birthday. Mm. I was about to say I'm waiting for a jump scare. Always, always, always believe in yourself because if you don't, who else will? Then who will, sweetie? Uh, photo of somebody's wife. Whoa. This was the other one. I was trying to find some way around to get to that one service area. Three, three, two, one. Two, one, two, sorry. Three, three, two, one, two. Oh, Albert Einstein. Uh, he might be dead. Does not seem like I can get in there, so I'm going to stop trying. Alpha quarter. I need a key card. Listen, buddy. Like I said before, we will Rose? do what we can. Who are you talking to? Ada. Oh, thank God. <coughs> yeah, some guy named Aubrey was broadcasting on our frequency. Said he was stuck in the engine halls and mentioned something about exotic energy. <laughs> I'd like some answers. Rose, I'd rather explain it in person. It's no, not Ada, what now you... is a great time to tell me what the hell is going on here. Fine, fine. I'll be brief. Listen. We discovered quantum resonance anomalies that prove the one electron theory, meaning that every electron in the universe is the same one moving back and forth through time. So naturally, we began to consider a second time dimension attached to the Euclidean analogy of Minkowski space. Now, I know what you're thinking. Ada. What about the Thompson conjecture? Ada, well, Ada, that's... Ada, 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 stop. It's me you're talking to. None of that nerd talk. That right. nerd talk. Uh, okay. A large experiment went boom. It ruptured a current of time and dangerous things have flooded through it. These things have been killing us. <sighs> all of us. We've tried to contain it all, but... The point is, we need to leave. Did you find my apartment? Yeah, but the Alpha Quarter is locked. I can't get in. I suppose you keep a spare keycard somewhere. Shit. No, wait! Yes, I do! My friend Eliza has a pair. God, I, I hope she's okay. She's on the ground floor, Gamma Quarter. Gamma? Mm -hmm. Then her entrance is covered in a web of live electricity cables. I can't get near it. Can you turn off the power source? The override code should be written in the Epsilon Guest Quarter. Easy peasy. Right. Hey, we basically did all that already. Listen, I'm entering another shielded section, so I'll lose my broadcast ability again, but I'll try to hurry. I'm getting closer. <laughs> Boom. Okay, so I was doing things out of order. Uh, what was it? It was three, three, 
212. Whoever was doing this might have been doing it to stay safe, which is not a bad strategy. Oh no, they're going to introduce the enemy in here. A plus T. What does that say on the wall? Looks like names. Oh no, never mind, I lied. Oh man, there's a lot of blood. Oh, hello. Can I take that? That might be useful. Uh, do you happen to have a key card? Oh! The circle. I thought that said Carol, that's why I thought it had names. The circle must be broken. Okay, nobody move. This would be a great place to do a jump scare. Yep. <laughs> I'm looking for a king. Okay, so I have yours. I'm going to look for a kings real quick. A king. Aubrey, Aubrey king. king. Can't be that many Aubreys on board. Right there. All right, well, Mr. King, I'm here at your, what? Why do you just have a sticker of his face with the eyes cut out? Cockroaches, nobody's behind me? Okay. You're being demoted. Okay, so that's why he wasn't happy with him. What's going on? Okay. There was a scuffle happening. Uh, and it does not concern me. I'm going in here. Hello. We know what you did. Do what we say, as we say, when we say, or we'll make sure your days aboard the Helios are over. We will be in touch. Okay. What did they do? Shuffleboard Sunday. I can get behind that. Did she say specifically where it was to look for? Oh, that looks like it right there. There we are. It is key cards. Let's go. Okay. It's all my fault. Okay. Uh, now we just need to get back without everything falling to crap. I read that already. Okay, I'm leaving. Please, nothing happen. Something's gonna happen. Oh, I feel like there's gonna be an enemy out there. Well, it's gotta happen sometime. Oh, I was right. So I need to go back over to where the rail station was? Oh, good gracious. Is he out there? How do I... Is there a crouch? Are you out there? I don't know if you are or not, but I'm... I'm just gonna go for it. That freaked me out for a second. <laughs> or was that just... A guy uh, ripple in time or something. Either way, I'm going this way and nobody can stop me. Except my desire to read whatever this is. Shuffleboard, great. <laughs> the one thing that's completely useless to my situation right now. Okay, nobody. I don't think he's actually out there. I think we're okay. Yeah, I don't see him. The circle must be broken. So do you think they pulled people from like the future or something? Okay, I think we're 
good. These work. Yes! Okay, and close the door. Uh, okay, it's not letting me close it. It's very fancy, very nice. Always appreciate music. Even though it's not really helping the atmosphere. Okay, here we go. Sister... <laughs> yeah, this is Ada's room, all right. Never did learn to clean her room properly. What the heck is this? Okay, some squigglies. That's it though. There's only one set of squigglies. Interesting. Could I do anything more with that? Like examine it or Okay. Taming a new kind of fire to raise mankind beyond its material limitations. Oh. You always did dream big, Ada. Ada. Here's another one. Does it have the same markings? This one's smaller. Fire. Was that supposed to be wind on the other one? Are we doing like an elemental deal? This one's smaller as well. Oh no, that one's wind. All those smarts, and you still maybe that one was water. Up in this mess. Hey Rose, where are you? I'm in your I made apartment. It to your apartment, and if we were to make it off the ship alive. I need to understand what's going on. For example, you said a future you wrote me the letter that brought me here. What does that even mean? My research is about exploiting loopholes in the flow of time. So a future me would write that letter and somehow send it back in time to get you here on the... Helios. Holy shit! Earth. And I think I know how! Listen, Rose, I need you to grab me some very important research. There's a secret room in my room. <clears throat> you find it while I make my way through another laboratory department. I'll give you a clue. It's center stage. That's it. You're just going to leave me to yeah, figure why this out you on just my tell own? Me. Have fun. It's center stage. Oh, I assume it's got to have to do with that. Move a picture. Here we go. Oh boy. Ah, uh, oh boy. That one had that. And the last one... Wind. And what could this be? Oh! This was the last thing I was expecting. Please, nothing grab my feet. Come aboard the Helios. We'll get together. Have a few laughs. Okay. Ugh. <laughs> Nasty. Okay, I'm glad that this chapter was longer than the last two. I was worried it's like one puzzle and then you're done. This one would have gone a lot faster if I had done things in order. I just happened to get ahead of myself. Her journal. So is it? This is the research. Fancy calculations. Go back in time. Mm. I thought it would be thicker. Okay. How's it going? Pretty good. I've got your notes. Although I'm afraid I found an error in your fancy calculations. <laughs> that would be the day. What did you find? Well, You've got massless gnome vectors intersecting with relativistic spoon dimensions. None of what you just said makes any sense whatsoever. <laughs> makes just as much sense to me as this notebook. These equations will allow you to send the letter back in time? Yes, and since you received it, I've technically already done it. Or will do it, depending on how you look at it. 
comforting to know that I'll at least live long enough to write it. But the research means so much more. It could it's a weird do storage so much space. more for all of us. Promise me you'll protect it. Promise me. Fine, I promise. But now what? I've divided the research into two pieces. You only have half of it. I'm on my way to pick up the other half. I'm just gonna go through the bio labs now and we'll... What the... Damn it! Rose, I'm trapped! Rose, I'm trapped in the bio labs! Rose... Hello? Rose, can you hear me? Ada. Halt! Ada! Piece of shit receiver. I'm just gonna leave, and if there's a jump scare or something, I'll know I'm going the right way. I've seen that already. Yep, I went the right way. Hello? Ah, our late arrival. A pleasure to finally speak to you, my dear. Allow me to introduce myself. I am Nikola Tesla. I know who you are. Now go away so I can speak to my sister. <laughs> I am afraid that won't be possible. As I'm sure you are aware, the Helios is under strict quarantine, and for that quarantine to be effective, I cannot have you and lead researcher Archa be opening containment doors all over this ship. The damage already caused is severe. I cannot allow you to make it worse. Therefore, the this both of open. you must remain at your current locations until this situation is resolved. You are locking us up? We will be sitting ducks for whatever is out there. Rest assured that I am doing everything that I can to remedy this situation. Right. How's that working out, huh? A ship full of dead scientists. The great Helios falling apart at the seams. Where's your unlimited energy now? <sighs> Coward. I am the sheepdog and I confront the wolves of the world. Hey, I like Ada. that. Are you okay? Ada. Hey, hi. Me again. Oh. What the heck? You too, just like me. <laughs> well then, some expert advice. Find a good clean corner that isn't tainted with this stench of death. That's step one. Not the kind of help I was hoping for. So you can get me out? Well, that depends. Where are you? The Alpha Quarter of the Faraday District. Some kind of lockdown gate came down. Can you open it? <coughs> My situation is uh, slightly more complicated. Aubrey, the door. Please. Pretty please. Go get your sister, I understand. Family first and Dang it, not so close. But I've okay, got family it. too, you know. And I'm still trapped. Help me, and I'll help you. Okay, Aubrey, deal. Help me get to my sister, and we will come together. There we go. Too. I promise. Scout's on Excellent. So I need you to stand away from the lockdown gate while I work my magic. Let me know when you found some decent cover, okay? Sure. That was wrong. Hang on. I really want to figure this out. I feel like that letter probably tells me what it is. Sheep to grass, wolves to sheep, sheepdog to wolves, sheepdog to man. Okay, so sheepdog to wolves, wolves to to sheep, man to sheepdog, and then Oh, so they're just giving me the wolves to sheep again? Okay. So we got LJ Ostrog. Always good to read their stuff. Okay, this doesn't seem like it's gonna help me with anything in here. Best decision I've ever made. Great things here. So many things I want to show you. Oh, some of this has been redacted. Some say that we are advancing through time from the past into the future. As if the ship advances through the sea into unknown waters, sometimes we think of ourselves as stationary, watching time go by as we would be standing on a bridge watching leaves and sticks fall downstream. Okay, that relates to the whole 
time is not a river deal. Sorry, so sorry. My bad. I might have sent a bit too much juice down the power lines. I'll be back in a minute. Just going to run some diagnostics and high five Benny. I think his arms should still be around here somewhere. Aubrey, I'll talk to you soon. What the heck is that? Oh, okay, goodbye. is wrong with the people here yeah Maybe I'm so right there with you answers. sheesh of course I'm gonna go the exact way that he was I feel like I've thoroughly escaped uh, how about not Ooh, good throw Wielding lunatic. Time is not a river. Time is not a river. Time is Do I need to go that way? Can I just leave this way? Whitechapel is an interesting term because that was the street that I think Jack the Ripper killed all his victims on. Oh, I physically cannot go this way. And I can't stand back up. So we're just gonna I am Holy shit, shut up, Aubrey, shut up, shut up, shut up. <laughs> I just Shh. a man get gutted by some nutcase with a knife. Oh no, that's no fake. Get me oh, that was the dude, here. that's whose bedroom we were in. Okay. Here. My sister is trapped. If she can't come to me, I'll go to her. Just get to the rail station gates. I'm here. <laughs> okay, I'm at the rail station gates. I'm at the gates. Get them open. Silently this time. Uh oh, yes, it's not gonna be silent. Here we go. It's gonna be freaking loud. I'm gonna have to book it too. He's gonna be right down the stairs. Going. Time to go, time to go, time to go. Who goes there? Stop! Oh. It's time to go. I feel like he's right on me. Just leave me alone. <laughs> I'm really not running super fast. Oh wow. I don't know where I'm going. Oh. Okay, jump it. You know, that seemed like a good idea on paper, but in execution, I don't think that was the right way to go. Please tell me I can jump over this. Nope. Hey Ludwig, how's it going? Okay, well, part of me was interested about this. Jeez. Take it easy, homeboy. You! You are mine! No! This is all you know, go. This is all my fault, he says. Oh, this is it. Bye-bye. You can't run from time, bro! I will have my revenge! You will pay for what you did! I didn't do anything yet. <laughs> you made it! 
isn't it? Wow, <laughs> what a sprint! I told you, Benny, she can run. Damn. Oh, you can see him. He's walking back. One leaf, one thorn. All right, the home of Hestia. Wow, that chapter went on longer than I thought it would. That was really fun. Um, oh man, it's almost 4 a.m. There was part of me that was going to do another episode of Bayonetta tonight, but I think I'll hold off on that just because it's so late. Um, I'm really enjoying this. I really like the style they're going for. Um, I'm interested to see... I'm going to hit go back to main menu. Um, I'm excited where they go with this now that we know that Rose is both the protagonist and could possibly, possibly be the antagonist as well. I don't know why people uh, don't like her, um, but we will see next time. Uh, I probably will play more of this either tomorrow uh, evening or the day after, just given where time is and my homework. Um, but in the meantime, thank you all so much for tuning in, those that tuned in to watch me do this live and those that will watch this later on, on YouTube. Um, you guys can hit me up on my social media, Facebook, Twitter, Instagram is the best way to reach me. Uh, leave a comment below and uh, let me know what you thought of the playthrough so far and what you'd like to see on the channel. And yeah, I'll see you guys in the next one.